Happy International Women's Day. I'm thrilled to be part of this celebration today of women across the world, of women being bold for change. So as I reflect on it, what does be bold for change mean? What are examples of women who, whose boldness really has inspired us all and in so doing has changed the world? I'm thinking today of two women, one whom I've never met but I've read about and the other whom I had the great privilege of working with. The first woman is Frances Perkins. Uh, Frances was born in the 19th century, um, became involved in the early labor movement, uh, became involved in both New York state politics and ultimately in federal politics. She became Franklin Delano Roosevelt's right-hand person when it came to labor policy and much of the apparatus of labor law in the United States that was the product of the New Deal came out of her hard work, protecting workers, women and men, uh, to make sure that their lives could be better. She was certainly bold for change, no question about that. More locally, I was so privileged to work with Pamela Hardigan. Pamela, Dr. Pamela Hardigan was a member of the Skoll Center for Social Enterprise. She directed the Skoll Center for a number of years until her untimely passing last summer. Pamela was bold for change in lots of ways. Uh, at the big level, you know, if you read her book, The Power of Unreasonable People, even though she used the term unreasonable, you could have struck out the word unreasonable and used the word bold. And she encouraged all of her readers, all the people who heard her talk, all the people she touched, to be bolder, to think about how they could be unreasonable, unreasonably principled, unreasonably kind, unreasonably tenacious. But at a very personal level, Pamela was also an example of being bold for change. I've met person after person who, in the wake of her passing, has come to me to tell stories about how Pamela inspired them to be bold, to take on a challenge they might not have thought they could take on, to try something that they might have worried whether they're capable of doing. Her boldness was at so many levels. When I think about these two women, uh, Frances Perkins and Pamela Hardigan, they inspire me. They remind me about the powerful women who have changed the world uh, and who we have much to be grateful for. So on this day, let's be bold for change, each of us. Thank you so much and thank you for participating in this International Women's Day. Have a wonderful day, but most importantly, keep the spirit of being bold for change in your hearts for the year to come.